Welcome back to my channel or of course welcome to my channel if you're new. If you are new then hello, lovely to meet you. My name is Alex and if you are new here make sure you stick around and subscribe. If you're not new and you've been here for a while then why not make sure that notification bell is switched on just so you're notified of every single time that I upload. Now for today's video and for the next few videos I have super exciting ones because Revolution just launched a few 12 days of Christmas like advent calendars and you just know that I had to buy all three of them. So yeah, we've got the Friends 12 Days of Christmas, which is what we're doing on today's video. I've then got the I Heart Revolution 12 Days of Christmas. And I've also got the Makeup Obsession Final Countdown. So those are what my next three videos are going to be, which is just so exciting i loved doing the iHeart revolution ones and the revolution ones last month and now it's actually starting to get to the time of year where all of these are coming out and it's just you know very exciting so for today's video we are going to be unboxing the friends and revolution merry christmas 12 days of christmas now i'm very very excited about this because I just had no idea that they'd be doing this, it, to be honest, like the, the I Heart Revolution one, Makeup Obsession one, you know, that standard, they do that every year, but, but they've never done like a themed collab 12 Days of Christmas, so yeah, really exciting. This is £40, so it's not the cheapest 12 Days of Christmas, um, I think I think the I Heart Revolution was 30 and the Makeup Obsession one was 40 I can't remember, it might be the other way around, um, so this isn't super, super cheap. But if you can find a discount code somewhere, you can get it a little bit cheaper. Um, this is what the advent calendar looks like. So it's in quite a thin box, actually. I was expecting it to be massive. I don't know why. Um, but it's in quite a small and compact box, which I'm really happy about because then it doesn't take up so much room. Um, so this is what the inside looks like when you take the lid off. You, of course, have 1 to 12 in here. I did have a little sneak peek on the website, but I haven't actually physically seen them in person so if you want to see what's inside the revolution and friends at 12 days of christmas calendar then please keep watching okay so number one is up here what is inside i just love that it's all christmasy oh my god i'm so excited for christmas oh okay so in the box number one we get a beauty sponge now if you can see on there that's when ross was dressed up as an armadillo wasn't he like how funny is that uh, but then on the back it just says friends x revolution and it is this be sorry if you can hear the motorbike outside it is a beautiful mint color as well so i love the look of this sponge and can't wait to use it because i actually love the other friend sponges because i still have them and use them okay so box number two is right next to it oh they've done scrunchies but it's like a three pack in one i actually really appreciate that because imagine if they put all three in like separate doors um so you get a rubber ducky one you get the um central perk one. Oh my god my nails caught on it oops and then you get the like mirror frame one so you get three little scrunchies in one i haven't worn a scrunchie in ages i don't know what's wrong with me um, but that is super super cute. I think there is kind of a little bit of a mixture in here, which is nice It's not that fun when it's always the same thing. Is it number three is a slightly larger box here Oh, we've got a little lipstick in here. This is cute So I don't think this has a name It just has friends and revolution on it and that is probably what the shade is going to be Yeah, that is a pretty bang on match to be fair it's quite a mauvey brown lipstick, which is cute. Um, again, I say this in all my like, advent calendar videos. If you do want me to do a video testing out the makeup from the advent calendar, then just let me know down below. We have a little bit of time before Christmas, so I should be able to squeeze a video in there. So number four is at the top here. I'm obsessed with this packaging. Like I think they really fought out this advent calendar, you know. Oh, that's cute. It's a little lip gloss, I think. I think it's a lip gloss. It could be a liquid lipstick or a lip gloss. But how cute is that packaging? And it's in a little mini form. That is so, so cute. Smells nice and it's got a little doe foot on it. 
I'm pretty sure that's a lip gloss. It has a little bit more of a watery consistency. I don't think that's a liquid lipstick. Um, so that's cute. I love that we've got a bit of variety in here so far. Number five is this larger toolbox here. Oh, we've got a spray. Ready to party check. We've got a spray in here as well. I wonder what this smells like. Oh, that really reminds me of something, but I can't think of what. It smells good, but I can't think of what it is. Um, I don't think it says either, but that smells really, really good. Quite a sweet scent. So again, super happy we've got something different in here. Number six is this little one in the middle. Feels a little bit more heavier. Oh, the packaging. I literally die. It's so adorable. So I don't know what this is. This is a lip balm. Firstly, look how cute the packaging is on that. And then the lip balm is kind of like a raspberry, pinky red shade. Um, These are super cute. I love that they've included like a bit of everything, like lip balm, you know, spray, scrunchies, uh, sponge. I, yeah, I really love the variety. Uh, number seven is the one just above it. Okay, this is something matching. I'm assuming it's going to be something different though. Yeah, this looks like a lip scrub. So firstly, we have the little candy cane packaging. And as suspected, this is a lip scrub. So you get a nice little lip care set in here, a lip scrub and a lip balm. Number eight is this big rectangle. Oh, that's quite a, that's quite a big box. That is the cutest little makeup bag ever. I'm sorry, but that is literally tiny. I don't know what on earth you'd fit in there, but look how small this makeup bag is and it's just got loads of ducks over it. Seriously though, what would you actually fit in here? It's tiny. Let me just thingy it out a well, sec. It's a little night out purse. For what though? Look how tiny it is. Yeah, you put your, your lip gloss in there. And that's it. Do you think this is more like for your handbag if you want the yeah. odd little bit of makeup? Yeah, like your lip gloss, a lipstick. Yeah, like your eye glue. A your eye glue, your lash glue. A what? What did you just say? Did you say a tampon? <laughs> I said it out. Why are you such a child? <laughs> I said it out, you know, in uh, with the millers. A tampon? A tampon. Do you need a tampon? <laughs> no, Mum, I don't need a tampon. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, that is a super cute makeup bag. Uh, definitely one just for your handbag and not your whole makeup routine. <laughs> Pretty much. So number nine is just above it here. Oh, these look like brushes. Oh, they're the little travel ones though. Okay. Going with the little bag. <laughs> yeah, the, these for the little makeup bag. These are little lobster like travel brushes. I'm not showing you very well. Um, the first one is this powder brush. Now I did say this in my uh, other unboxings this year that I do actually like this one to use for powder like on the go because it's so little uh, This is what that one looks like the one that I don't like however is this pointless flat brush this like long Flat brush. I just I would never ever reach for this not even in my handbag I don't think and then you have a little a little flat shader brush so, I mean, it's cute that they've included them, but will I reach from a lot? Probably not. Number 10 is this one here. Oh, we're getting to the exciting ones now. Ugh. Well, the whole thing's exciting, but these are especially exciting. So we have a little eyeshadow palette. These are definitely smaller than, are they? Are they smaller than the character palettes? I think they are a little bit smaller. So this is what the packaging looks like. And this says when your favorite tune comes on, and this is what the palette looks like. This is a super beautiful, colourful palette. I really, really like that. There are, I think, three mattes in here, which is such a shame. I would have preferred if there was more mattes in there, but it is a pretty palette, nevertheless. I imagine this is also an eyeshadow palette. It's in very similar packaging, yeah. I'm pretty sure these are smaller than the normal character palettes. And this one says, did somebody say party? And it's got little candy canes on it. 
and this one is definitely more of your neutral eyeshadow palette however as you can see there are only one two three mattes and the other ones are all shimmer which is such a shame if i was to test these i'd probably use both of them in the same sort of testing video because lack of mattes it's just it's just not it is it guys okay and we are on to number 12 which is the last box this massive one here i mean it's cute but number 12 really it's a mirror and uh, do you know what i'm not gonna lie this is actually one of the most cutest mirrors i've ever seen in my life just because it's a really small like compact mirror and I actually think that's a good size for like in your handbag so I will give it that however you can't leave number 12 to be a mirror we needed like the palettes or something to be number 12 um this gift set guys is really good I'm not gonna lie you may be able to get a little bit cheaper um in maybe October time or November if you don't want to quite spend 40 pounds but I am going to recommend this advent calendar, especially if you love Friends and especially if you loved the whole Friends and Revolution collections. I know I did, um, I reviewed all of it and I'm super excited about this advent calendar so I'd love to know what your thoughts are down below. So that is it for this video, I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did please let me know by smashing the thumbs up button, let me know down below what you think of this advent calendar and of course if you haven't already please subscribe down below and I will see you in my next video. Bye!